Here, we're just given the two points. We're not given the graph. But we know if we have two points, we can find the slope by using the slope formula y1 minus y2 all over x1 minus x2. So in this case, it would be 5 minus a negative 1 all over negative 3 minus 0. Keep change, change. That gives us a positive 6 over a negative 3, which equals a negative 2. And again, this point right here is our y-intercept because it has an x value of 0. So that means our b is equal to a negative 1. And these are the two things we need to know. We need to know that our m is equal to an rb. So my equation is y equals a negative 2 times x minus 1. And there's the answer for letter A. Now again, I'm going to need to uh, erase this. So if you want to pause this and make sure you get this written down in your notes before I erase it, that'd be a great idea. Now in letter B, we're going to do the exact same thing. So again, we'll use a slope formula. So we subtract our y, so it's negative 5 minus a negative 5 all over 0 minus 8. Keep change, change. That gives us 0 on top over a negative 8. So that means my slope is 0. And then again, this is my y-intercept. So my b is a negative 5. So I'd have y equals 0 times x minus 5. But again, with a 0 slope, that just makes that term go away. So this actually happens to be the horizontal line of y equals a negative 5.